<laughs> no, you're African queen. <laughs> no, you're Saudi queen. In a never seen fashion, British Nigerian world heavyweight champion Anthony Joshua has been trending on Nigerian Twitter since November 20, 2022, following reports that billionaire Harris DJ Copy is now engaged to British boxer Ryan Taylor. This is coming after the gelato hitmaker was captured in a viral video getting a ring from Taylor at the Gumball 3000 award night in Abu Dhabi in what is now widely believed to be a marriage proposal. In the video, Taylor went on one knee and popped the question to which he got a yes. The suspected secret lovers then shared a passionate kiss amid a cheering crowd while Marry You, a song by Bruno Mars played in the background. The heartwarming proposal video has left many fans excited and happy for the billionaire daughter who has been searching for the one for a long time. But at the same time, Copy's engagement has many tongues wagging about the man she settled for. According to many, the jollof on the jet crew only settled for Taylor, a less known boxer, because a relationship with Anthony Joshua refused to sail. It's no secret that fans have always assumed that Anthony Joshua and the award-winning disc jockey would end up together. <laughs> Since 2019, the duo have sparked dating rumors many times than we can count. Aside from the 33-year-old English professional boxer once gifting Copy a customized diamond necklace, the duo have been seen vacationing together and cozying up like teenagers in love. That's not all. Copy has always been Anthony Joshua's biggest fan, even recently admitting that with or without his belt, she will always be proud of him. As you can imagine, the heavyweight champion has also been a major support system for the Pepsi ambassador. As we would see in May 2022, when he paid her a visit to Oxford University during a master's program. Despite their public display of affection and numerous public appearances, Copy has always maintained they are nothing but friends, but to fans watching their every move and gesture, their friendship is just a blossoming romance that is bound to happen. Now coming on the heels of the Afrobeat star's engagement to British professional BMX rider and boxer Ryan Taylor, fans cannot help but ask. Did Copy settle for this upcoming boxer because a relationship with Anthony Joshua refused to sail? Hello guys, it's Tiko here for African Glitz. 33-year-old professional boxer Anthony Uluafemi Joshua aka AJ may have been born in England but he has always been proud of his Nigerian heritage. Among diehard fans who have seen the Ijebu native speaking Yoruba doing the proper cultural greeting and even confessing that Eba and Egusi, a Nigerian delicacy, is the secret to his success. The pounded jam, Eba, you know, Egusi, so <laughs> that's, that's, that's the secret of the success. <laughs> I'm a Nigerian man by blood, yes. The heavyweight champion wants to stay connected to his roots. And what better way to do this than fostering a relationship with another Nigerian family based in the UK, but very much proud of their Nigerian heritage. As you must have guessed, that's the Otedola family. After meeting with the billionaire family patriarch Femi Otedola by Sherlock in Dubai in November of 2017, the English boxer has only grown closer to the family. Over the years, AJ has managed to maintain a really cozy bond with the Otedolas, but especially with one of the billionaire's daughters, Florence Otedola, better known as DJ Copy. As you must have guessed, the cozy bond between these two may have been declared platonic to the public. But fans who think Copy and the delectable Anthony Joshua look great together would not stop shipping them. But can we blame fans when the UK-based celebrities have sparked dating rumors countless times? <music> DJ Copy, a proud Manchester United football club supporter, has never hidden her extreme love for sports. In September 2020, after publicly dumping Asna FC for the Red Devils, the singer signed a significant deal with the football club. Alongside South London rapper Sam Wise and social media personality Harry Pinero, the gelato hitmaker began modeling the third Manchester United kit in no time. Apart from her love for football, the billionaire Harris is head over heels in love with car racing. 
However, Koppi is first an avid fan of boxing. It could be because of the thrills of the theatrics that come up before every match or just the sort of delectable men into this kind of sport. We would never know. But what we would know is that this is how the singer got to know British Nigerian boxing star Anthony Joshua. The first ever photos of them together surfaced as far back as April 2016. Copy bumped into the then IBF heavyweight champion in London while partying with friends. The Jalof on the Jet Kruna introduced herself as a fan and took a photo with AJ. A year after, Femi Otedola and Anthony Joshua ran into each other in Dubai in November of 2017 and it must have felt like fate was making a loud point. Next, we heard Copy had already become a regular face at Anthony Joshua's matches in 2018. In September of the same year, the award-winning remixer got a VVIP ticket to watch AJ's match with Alexander Povetnik, where he retained his world heavyweight titles. Following the match, Copy was captured with the boxer's sister, Janet, posing with the WBO belt and later posing with the boxer himself. But fans dismissed the paparazzi as yet another of the Bologna Heresy's adventures. Surprisingly, less than a year after the duo made the news when Anthony Joshua paid a visit to Nigeria in July of 2019. Welcome to Lagos! Let's get it! <laughs> the boxing king had a wonderful time visiting the Makoko area in Lagos, the new African shrine, his father's house in Ijebode, Ogun State, and a host of other places. The father of one alongside his sister, Janet, was equally hosted by Africa's richest man, Aliko Dangote, on his 15.5 billion naira yacht. But some of AJ's best moments in Nigeria that stood out was linking up with Kopi in Lagos. The duo was spotted enjoying a boat cruise date in the Lagos Lagoon while vibing to one of Ike Dairu's songs. After this, Anthony visited the Otedola's palatial family home in Ikoyi, Lagos. Confirming what many didn't suspect months later, the English boxer gave a shout out to the Otedolas on social media, saying he owes his wonderful trip in Nigeria to them. Sharing a documentary of his visit, he wrote on Instagram, My friend, the Otedola family, big respect to them. They helped organize my last trip, ensuring things were in place. As you can imagine, the Otedolas and Copy, especially, playing host to the heavyweight champion, didn't make much sense until a month after when the gelato singer and AJ were captured vacationing at a beach in Spain together. One word. Gelato. The only problem. What? Where is the gelato? I left it in Lagos. <laughs> Fans read a different meaning to their relationship, which sparked their first dating rumors. The rumors further intensified in October of 2019 when Copy, alongside her father, Femi Otedola, showed up for the birthday party of the boxer's son in London. While the party was going on, Anthony Joshua pulled a loud romantic card when he gifted the singer a customized Oted Dollar diamond gold chain. The father of one also presented a special gift to DJ Copy's dad. Flaunting the expensive necklace hours later, the singer promised to wear it everywhere. I rarely get given, as I am always the one to give, so I am grateful for the gift from AJ. Going to rock this chain everywhere like a boss. Ote hashtag boss down she wrote on Instagram. Copy fans who have grown tired of her complaining about her single status immediately began celebrating that she had finally found the one. In December of 2019, Copy's fans felt there was no going back when she travelled with AJ's family to watch his fight in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, to reclaim his belt. Not only did people see a supportive girlfriend in Copy, they saw one that AJ's mother and sister loved. This explains why Janet Joshua represented her brother at Copy's charity fundraising event in November 2019. Anthony couldn't attend, but his sister must have known how much he didn't want to disappoint Copy, so she stood in for him. Fast forward to February 2020, the only handwriting fans saw was a wedding loading. This was fueled by a rumor that Copy and Anthony Joshua are sleeping together. DMW rapper Ido West had jumped on the latest trend, making a cover of Mayo Kun's hit song, Gang. At one point, while freestyling, the rapper said in Yoruba, Wanikpe Joshua la DJ Kopi. Catching her own cruise later that year, the singer shared a photoshopped picture of her and the English boxer wearing traditional wedding outfits. Sharing the photo in a tweet on October 1, 2020, to wish Nigerians a happy Independence Day, Kopi wrote, Eku Diamond Jubileo causing fans to go wild in the excitement that an engagement is loading between the duo. 
Sadly for fans, Copy killed the rumors in November 2020 after one of her cupcakes asked if she was planning to marry AJ. In response, Copy said she is just friends with the boxer, but he will make a great husband one day. lives a very public life on social media, often leaving nothing to the imagination, from flaunting her family wealth to her minor and major wins. However, it's very rare for Copy to flaunt her male and female friends on the internet. For a long time, not many people knew she was best friends with Benue Bilonia's son, Kid Wire, until his stint on Big Brother Ninja. Taking notes of this, fans found it hard to believe that Copy was just friends with Anthony Joshua even after she tried to dispel the rumors of them dating. We mean, she was wearing the customized jewelry it gifted her everywhere. In May of 2022, AJ paid Copy a surprise visit at Oxford University where she was undergoing a master's program in African studies. Sharing goofy photos of them together, the work crooner was captured wearing the neck piece it gifted her while she lauded AJ as the most intellectual boxer she knows. She wrote on Instagram, Look who came all the way to Oxford University. Do you reckon Anthony Joshua would make a great research assistant for my thesis? LOL. Copy made the loudest noise when the boxer had a match in a row. This we would see in August of 2022. Ahead of Anthony Joshua's fight with Alexander Yusik in Jeddah, Saudi Arabia, to become a three time world heavyweight champion, Copy showered him with prayers on social media. Tweeting, the singer wrote, Tonight is finally the fight night. Praying got you and cheering you in every way possible, Femi, let's go champ. Never for once has her support for the boxer's career wavered, not even when he lost his rematch to Yusik and became the laughing stock on Nigerian Twitter. Boosting AJ's morale, Copy tweeted hours after that she is proud of the boxer whether he has his belt or not and wrote, So proud of Femi, with or without belts, always my champ, at Anthony Joshua. Oh, and before I forget, bleep the haters, calling his middle name so affectionately and even picking up a fight with his haters on social media according to many is something a mere friend would not do. So many have since concluded that they are either secret lovers or bound to marry one day. Unfortunately and fortunately, the Oxford University graduates reportedly engaged to another British man, Ryan Taylor. The surprise engagement no one saw coming happened on November 20, 2022 at the Gumball 3000 Award Night in Abu Dhabi. As Copy and Ryan Taylor began to share PDA moments after the engagement, Fans have been dropping hot takes about why Copy settled for him. According to social media users, Copy, who recently turned 30, must have felt a biological clock fast ticking and grew tired of her friendship with Anthony Joshua heading nowhere to marriage. While maintaining a close relationship with Joshua, the famous singer must have met Taylor, who has not only been described as a low budget Anthony Joshua but friends with him. Once things didn't swing positively with AJ, Copy allegedly moved to his friend, Ryan Taylor. After all, he is a boxer too, and she wins in the end. However, some people disagree as they claim Anthony Joshua wasn't claiming copy openly and giving her the loving attention she needed until Ryan Taylor came along. Should we go for a swim? Like in our clothes, everything on right now? Morning. Yeah. Let's go quick, quick. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you first or me first? Is it, is it cold? Why are you taking clothes off? Ah! We said take fully your clothes. shoes off, take your shoes off. And we leave. said fully clothes. Maybe take it. Come, fall in. <laughs> Not the boots. <laughs> <laughs>
not the best. <laughs> Reacting to Copy's new relationship and move, popular influencer Omotayo of Lagos wrote, I really love intentional women like DJ Copy so much. If Anthony Joshua doesn't work out, Taylor will definitely work out. It's either a boxer or nothing. Another user wrote, Madam Copy seems obsessed with boxers. Her attempt at Anthony Joshua didn't work earlier, but it seems her dream has finally come true with another British boxer. Also reacting, a user tweeted, I now see why DJ Copy always has the name of Anthony Joshua on her lips. He may have introduced her to this British boxer guy who engaged her. Also reacting, another Twitter user wrote, I just listened to Anthony Joshua's side of the story. Waiting, Copy no try at all. She for at least fix a match between Joshua and Taylor since she loves boxers, while Larry the Badon boy can wait for substitution in case Taylor tap out. Tell us guys, what do you think about Copy's decision to accept an engagement from Ryan Taylor? Do you think she settled for him due to her biological clock and after her relationship with Anthony Joshua failed to sail? Or Anthony Joshua wasn't giving her the attention she wanted and Ryan Taylor stepped in to do the job? Share your opinion in the comment section down below. If you found this video informative, please comment, like and share. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to be notified every time I upload a new video so that you don't miss out. Thanks for watching and see you on our next one.